Have you ever wondered how much energy lies within the heart of a single atom? Welcome to our journey into the world of nuclear energy, a tale spun from the smallest building blocks of the universe, atoms. Picture an atom if you will, it's a tiny universe in itself, a nucleus at the center with protons and neutrons orbited by electrons. Now imagine unlocking the energy held within this minuscule world. The power within an atom is immense, more than you could possibly fathom. It's the same power that fuels the sun and the stars, the same power that gives life to our world. This is the energy we're talking about when we talk about nuclear power. Indeed, the energy contained in the heart of an atom is mind-boggling. It's like a sleeping giant waiting to be awakened, and once unleashed, it holds the potential to change our world. The power of the universe lies within these tiny particles, and we have found a way to harness it. The real magic happens when we start splitting atoms, a process known as nuclear fission. This isn't your everyday magic trick, it's a feat of scientific wonder that has been harnessed to power our world. So, how does this atom-splitting business work? Well, it all begins with a single neutron. This tiny particle, smaller than the eye can see, is fired at an atom of uranium. Now, uranium is a heavy element, packed full of protons, neutrons, and electrons. It's like a tightly wound ball of energy, just waiting to be released. When the neutron collides with the uranium atom, it's like a cue ball striking in a game of pool. The uranium atom splits apart, breaking into two smaller atoms and releasing a massive amount of energy in the process. This is nuclear fission, the splitting of an atom. And it's not just a one-time thing, you see, when the uranium atom splits, it doesn't just release energy, it also releases additional neutrons. These newly freed neutrons then go on to collide with other uranium atoms, causing them to split and release more energy. It's a domino effect, a chain reaction of energy release. In a nuclear power plant, this chain reaction is carefully controlled. The energy released from the splitting atoms heats water, turning it into steam. This steam then spins turbines, which generate electricity. It's a complex process, but at its heart, it's all about splitting atoms and harnessing the energy that's released. The beauty of nuclear fission is in its efficiency. A small amount of uranium can generate a huge amount of power. It's like lighting a match and getting a bonfire. But it's not without its challenges. The process needs to be carefully controlled to prevent a runaway reaction. And just like that, a chain reaction of energy release begins, powering our world in a blink. It's a dance of particles and energy, a ballet of atomic proportions. And it's happening right now, in nuclear power plants across the globe. It's the art of splitting atoms, and it's truly a marvel of modern science. Harnessing nuclear power is like wielding a double-edged sword. It's a power source that can provide immense benefits, but it also comes with its own set of risks. On the one hand, nuclear power has the potential to generate electricity on a massive scale, without producing greenhouse gas emissions that contribute to climate change. Imagine the kind of power that can light up entire cities, power industries, and yet leave the air as clean as if all we used were wind turbines and solar panels. That's the promise of nuclear power. It's an energy source that doesn't rely on fossil fuels, and therefore doesn't spew out carbon dioxide into our atmosphere. But like any sword, nuclear power has another edge. The process of nuclear fission, while highly effective in generating power, also produces nuclear waste a byproduct that remains radioactive and dangerous for thousands of years. It's a challenge that requires careful management and robust safety measures to ensure that it doesn't pose a risk to human health or the environment. And then, there's the risk of nuclear accidents. While modern nuclear power plants are designed with multiple layers of safety features, the potential for a catastrophic accident, as we've seen in places like Chernobyl and Fukushima, remains a concern. Finally, there's the question of nuclear technology itself. It's a powerful tool that can be used for good or ill. The same technology that can light up a city can also be used to create weapons of mass destruction. It's a sobering thought, and a reminder of the responsibility that comes with wielding such a potent tool. As with any powerful tool, the key lies in how we use it. Nuclear power for all its potential benefits and risks is no different. It's a tool that can help us combat climate change, power our societies and push the boundaries of what's possible. But it's also a tool that must be used wisely, with an understanding of its risks, and a commitment to managing them effectively. So where does nuclear power stand in our future? As we move into an era where sustainable, clean energy is the goal, nuclear power is expected to play a pivotal role. While the idea of harnessing the power within an atom may seem daunting, 
Ongoing research and technological advancements are making it safer and more efficient. One of the promising advancements in nuclear technology is fusion power. Unlike fission, where atoms are split to release energy, fusion combines atoms, much like the sun does. Fusion has the potential to provide an almost limitless supply of clean, safe energy. It's a process that doesn't produce harmful, long-lived radioactive waste, making it a greener alternative. Then there's thorium reactors. Another exciting prospect on the horizon. Thorium is more abundant and safer to use than the uranium used in most current reactors. A thorium reactor produces less waste, and the waste it does produce is less dangerous. Moreover, it's virtually impossible for a thorium reactor to have a meltdown, which significantly reduces the risk of a catastrophic event. But what does this mean for our growing energy needs? With the world's population expected to reach over 9 billion by the middle of the 21st century, we'll need to double our current energy production to keep up. Nuclear power, with its ability to generate massive amounts of energy from a small amount of fuel, could be the answer. It's clear that nuclear power has a role to play in our future. It can provide a stable, reliable source of energy, reducing our dependence on fossil fuels and helping to combat climate change. But as with any technology, it comes with challenges, such as waste management and safety concerns. The future of nuclear power is still being written, but one thing is clear. The energy within the atom will continue to shape our world in ways we can only begin to imagine.